And on this week's product coffee review, maker. Mr. Coffee 12 Cup and Programmable Coffee Maker. It isn't the basic one, it's a little bit upgraded one, which I like. So I'm going to be opening it, coffee maker, and it, this is programmable, it's got a taste test, freshness timer, brew strength selector, it has a little filter here that is supposed to help with the uh, impurities in the water. And if I remember right, I think I've seen these before. Sometimes I use them, sometimes I don't. Got my little booklet here, Mr. Coffee. Please do us a favor and subscribe to this channel and give it a like if you would. And uh, make sure you smash that notification bell so you know when we upload new videos every week. Thank you. They have it packed in here really well, as you can see. It looks like all the packaging it's is biodegradable, pack. which is so important nowadays. They have tape here to keep it secure. So I would say this has been packaged really well. Let's see, what does it look like? Oh, yes. Nice. Crap. This is the little... This is the little frame that I believe holds this filter. has this little spring action so that when you put the pot in and then you want to maybe get a cup to drink while it's still brewing the rest of the 10 cups or whatever, you can just take it out, the coffee will stop. You can pour your coffee, and you don't have coffee pouring out as you're doing that, and then you put it back in, and you know, continue brewing. Are you going to brew your first cup of coffee and review it for us? Yes, I'm going to brew my first cup of coffee. And, and try it because right now we've been using a little tiny travel one and like a four cup machine four cup machine yes and I can drink four cups in one setting so and you can see all the nice styles that it has well I can't but you can and it has a timer uh, it has a delayed and timer that's also that a, can, a clock it's a clock and a d delayed timer so that you can set it 
for uh, when you want to get up in the morning, have your coffee brewed for you. That's this great. Really nice. Is it all now? Yeah. Okay. Wait a second. Okay. Go ahead. So I've already cleaned this pot um, with some soap and water to make sure that it was all nice and clean. I filled it up with water. And I'm going to go ahead and pour it in for the first time before you use it with coffee. You want to pour a cold, fresh water in there to kind of clean it out. And I'm going to push through. And the features that it has is a uh, brew, you have uh, a regular brew or you can set it for a stronger brew, which is what I would like. I like stronger coffee. And it's making all kinds of noises, which I guess is normal. see it's coming out really good it's heating up it's nice and steamy let's see if I was to take this out right now it should stop in midstream and it does. So the first, the first cup or the first uh, cleaning that you do with a pot of hot water or cold water, you can smell a little bit of a plasticky smell. That's because it's new nothing to worry about is that the snorting pug or is that the coffee maker that's the coffee maker and this is the snorting pug looking at the coffee maker. She says, oh, that looks pretty good. I'd rather it be food, though. Okay, so that should be cleaned out. I'm going to turn it off. I rarely make a 12 pot of coffee. I usually like just about mm, six cups. That's just enough for both of us. Ow, that's hot. I've got the coffee filters that in there. And for six cups of coffee, I use a scoop like this. I've had this scoop. It's an actual old Mr. Coffee scoop that I've had for probably 30, 40 years. So it's an antique. And I use three of these heaping to make six cups because I like strong coffee. Pour it in. Mm 
and I'm going to turn it on. And pretty soon we'll have a nice hot cup of coffee. This is my favorite cup. It's a cup I got uh, made special with uh, my little uh, chihuahua that uh, died a couple years ago. She was very special to me, to us. And her name was Gigi. She was 10 years old. She um, was blind from the time she was three months old. She had a, an illness that caused her to go blind young. So she was a special needs puppy. But she got along really great as far as adjusting to her blindness. And she was, she was our special baby. So this is a little picture of her that I had made with angel wings. That's my favorite cup. Hi. Are you ready? I'm cutting, cutting your head off. Okay. Hi, I'm Kim with the Snorting Pug Channel. And today I'm going to review a Mr. Coffee programmable coffee maker, advanced brew. It has a delayed brew reaction to it so that when you open the, uh, take the, <laughs> take the thing out of the,